think you know Ninja songs? Old school or new school? Stand a chance to win big on Gusto Guess the Song. To be a part of this, call the numbers on your screen right now. Come on board and let's do things the Gusto way. Hey guys, welcome to Gusto News on Gusto TV. Today on the news, I've got Omale alongside Tells is also um, Mama Jam Jam to Asabate. And also, you know, rounding up the news with Big Wiz. But of course, thank you. Thank you so, so much. Yes, thank you for the likes. Thank you for the comments. Thank you for telling people about Gusto TV. Thank you for sharing our content. You should keep doing so. And for those of you who are seeing our videos for the first time, like, what are you waiting for? Mm, join us. Just click on the subscribe button and as well on the notification bell. Somebody said you usually join me when I get to this place because he knows I will say, <laughs> you know, so you get to see our content when it drops. Yes, you get to see it too. Or when we're going live, yeah. So um, the start of the news. Yep. Uh, with um, the number one person on this news, there are actually two of them. It's Omale and Tells, producer, songwriter. Well, contrary to what you might be thinking, not just CK made the list of the YouTube, you know, black voices for this month. It's good to see that three Nigerians are on that one. This is an amazing one for us. It's good to know that, you know, when things like this happen, you don't get to see just one Nigeria on it. You know, you get to see two, three, sometimes five, you know, on the list. And for this one, joining CK on that table is Omale and Tells. Well, Amale, of course, excited about being on the artist class of YouTube Black um, Voices. Went to as well, just like CK did on his IG page to say, super proud to be pr uh, to be part of the hashtag YouTube Black Voices class of 2022. Yeah, um, another step in this blessed journey. Thank you at YouTube Music. Man, this is an amazing one. For these guys to actually find themselves on this list, you know, when you want to think about artists that might find their way here you just easily go oh maybe a whiskey or maybe a david do will be on this one maybe a tiwa or yemi you know but these guys of course have been able to prove that they are really you know the future of africa and of course afrobeat you know being on this list you can see people here commenting love bad boy ole and a lot of people celebrating one now moving on to the next person still on this class is songwriter and producer class uh tells went on as well on his ig page super excited extremely grateful went on to say extremely honored to be part of the youtube uh, black voices music class along with 21 other incredible songwriters and producers uh check out my work on a youtube music voices uh Bla youtube black voices uh playlist yes quite amazing 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 you know for artists to be on this days it's good to know that our songwriters producers as well you know are getting this sort of recognition a lot of times we're like oh those behind the camera behind you know making the sounds and all of that do not get enough accolades but you know with platforms like youtube celebrating them we get to know you know the faces behind the amazing songs you know and hit songs that we get to dance to so yes congratulations to omale congratulations to tells and of course we've got ck on this list as well i earlier mentioned that anyways uh moving on to the next on this news is tiwa savage so as I decided to sub us this morning, you know, she came up, of course, with um, a picture of herself on her IG page looking really, you know, beautiful and classy. You know, the type of Stiwa you'd regularly know. I mean, it's good to know that amidst all the basketballs, all the discussion, Twitter trend and all of that, you know, in one week, or let me say in one day, the type of trend Stiwa had, you know, across social media is like the combination of all the dramas we've been having since last month to this time. And, you know, it takes a really strong person to be under such a heat, looking at, uh, you know, uh, the type of person she is, society, a list artist, a list artist, you know, uh, of course, a mother, you know, daughter, a lot of things, you know, uh, and she's able to actually hold it strong. Well, she's finally said something about all the, you know, thoughts people have about her. You know, some people are coming from the angle of, oh, do I would see why I do that? Some people are like, look, we all make mistakes. You guys should just leave her, you know, some other posting a picture, tagging her and calling her a queen and all of that because she's already come out to say that there is a video and he might make his way online. Well, she comes up to say, um, charge that shit to the game and never speak on it again. Hmm. So what's still trying to say, you know, 
she's like charge it to the game like okay maybe she's trying to use the you know the the whole noise around her now for her own good of course it's believed that no publicity is bad yes it depends on how you're able to use it for your good or not and she went on to say and never speak on it again this is just like her saying you know what you guys it's enough i'm not gonna say anything i owe you nobody an explanation and that's on period you know anyways you see some people are here like say swagger just to tyf facts only and of course you can see chairman of Pata is here saying i'm with you babes of course there's a couple of women like women supporting women but anyways to us said that look i'm using this for my good and i'm not going to say anything to any of you no explanation and that's final anyways okay okay it's good it's good for us to see that you know it's finding a way to actually you know go through uh the process so let's move on to the last on this news is whiskey mm, for months there's barely a news be it online or you know discussion people where whiskey will not pop up which has really proved that you know he's not just called superstar or star boy because of the name of course he's been able to do a whole lot of things for himself recently you know aside what has happened in the past i mean in more than a decade in the industry you know he's been able to grow seeing him become of course an international artist have a song on the billboard first nigerian song to do that you know the longest african song on the billboard at the moment you know made in lagos of course you know, has been able to beat albums on like fella that have been holding you know, years of you know um, records to themselves quite a lot has happened around whiskey and the made in lagos but you know when artists are this successful you know people tend to just you know praise him whenever something happens whiskey fc are on twitter they are trending him say oh whiskey just reached one billion organic you know viewership on youtube coming out to say oh made in lagos has been able to beat angelic schedules 20 something years record you know they keep just listing how many records whiskey keep breaking week in week out you know some of the records that you know you just like who will break this anyways i've seen a lot of people follow that strides again but this is just to show that it's not just whiskey that do this yes he has gone on to celebrate his manager yes we know of course we see jada p a whole lot of times people talk about her people go on twitter to celebrate her for you know all the works that is coming out from the whiskey brand but here was a post picture of sunday Are and himself on his story and he went on to say big thanks to you okay big thank you to this man my manager slash father and friend love you for life thank you for holding me down the most can't imagine any of this without you i mean so when you see whiskey doing so well some of the people behind the closed doors who are consistently working to make sure that whiskey uh, is who he is today is sunday area and of course whiskey has gone on on his instagram story to say a big thank you to him i mean of course uh you have to appreciate people who have stuck with you been able to grow and help you grow as well and of course sunday Array is that one on whiskey corner that has been there for him and of course he cannot hold it to himself saying a big thank you to him so fc maybe you should just say thank you to sunday Array on behalf of whiskey in the comment section as well others can tell us what to think about this news we'll be right there to respond to your comment but if you're new to the channel yes you know i wouldn't just round up without forgetting you guys please join us by clicking on the subscribe button as well on the notification bell and i'll see you on the next news bye